And we're back with an inscription. We're gonna have to go because our recording software does not like this game. You know what, kids? If they told you, don't let your dreams be dreams, it's true. If you want to burn down an orphanage, oh, do wait. it. Eat babies, do it. What? Burn all the babies. Uh, disclosure, most of those things are against the law. We do not condone acts against the law. You call them laws. I say it's a checklist. All right. A, a fun checklist of things not friend. to do. Okay, well, a checklist of a fun afternoon with the boys. That's, no. getting it. That's getting edited out. I no, might, it's not. I might be muting you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> you know what? They told me to always shoot for the moon. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe and it you have an among the stars. So I bought myself oh, a skull rifle shot toward the sky. Oh man, I forgot that it is a lot louder. Alright. Did that change anything for you guys? Yeah, it's quieter. Okay. Another challenger. It has been ages. Perhaps you have forgotten how this game is played. I know how to play Yahtzee. Allow me to remind you. I need to move where my mic is because I can't read the screen and say things at the same time. <laughs> uh, okay, that squirrel. Play the squirrel card, and now you're stowed. Stowed's cost one blood, an honorable death. Okay, well, Harry didn't want to say his line. Hmm. I'm only paid hourly. <laughs> Wolves require two sacrifices. Ring the bell to end your turn. Your stoat stands unopposed. The number at the bottom left. Okay, we've said this already. Let's just pass. This is hurting my voice. I mean, like, yeah. Fuck you. Full, full disclosure for everyone. We have actually played this game and beat the first part of this game. Um, but... Uh, we haven't actually progressed past that, and we also had to keep resetting because our recording software keeps crashing on it. So, hooray! Here's, you here's win! Attempt number four. You win if you tip my side all the way down to the bottom. I promise like Harry, this! Harry will put on a real voice when we get to a serious moment. Absolutely not. <laughs> okay, well then, it might be Sebastian picking up uh, oh, that. Oh, boy! Your stoat stands in the way of my coyote. coyote. Oh, God. Matt, how do you feel about being my the big bad? My coyote deal two <laughs> damage to your stoat. Stoat. The big bad, bless you, that we're fighting here. Uh, I guess. <laughs> I, I'll, I'll be will serious when I, I need to be serious. I, I, okay, okay, I, that's fine. I, yeah, I'll, I'll be serious when I need to be serious. Damn it. I mean, I can't, I can, stupid. but I can't. I can't promise how long I can do my net, my like sort of like deep demonic voice. Oh, it's it's all good. Voice. You you don't need to do deep demonic voice. We can trade the character off when we need to. Either way, I'm wasting time. Oh. That means your stoke is too is too less. less. Oh god! If a creature's health <laughs> reaches zero, it dies. Dies. Yeah. It's your turn again. Your turn again. Uh, I you may draw your... <laughs> Wait, why are two How no. at the same time? Who's, what because, part is which? So those two have always read for this guy because it made a really nice dramatic effect when they both did it for the demonic voice side of things. Uh, but uh, now they're doing this version instead. So. <laughs> it turns out no. that my voice just has a natural echo in this building. Huh? Okay. Yes, yeah, that's totally how it works. Fear not, the beast is sacrificed, but not removed from your deck. Its suffering was real, but you will see it again. Because you are learning, I will pass. Again, the choice, a random card from your deck, or the certainty of a squirrel. Hmm, I want this. Yeah. Beep. Boop. Three damage dealt, damage dealt. three weights on the scale. scale. Pass. Pass. Oh, I squirrel. 
Squirrel. Either way, I win now. You've won, you this, won match. this match. They won't all, they won't be, all so be so easy. Is this like the true start of the game? Yeah, I fully reset. Oh, nuts. <laughs> oh, nuts. <laughs> Well, look, we've never we've never gotten a recording that fucking didn't crash completely, so... Okay. I guess it's time to be serious now. Well, that was certainly fun. You were lost deep in the wood. A single path revealed itself. Two denizens of the fu fuck you. <laughs> I didn't realize we were yep. like. <laughs> it was in the middle. Of... Oh man, good thing. Good thing that was reflexive and wasn't actually with my brain. <laughs> Give me one second. Okay. <laughs> the caustic. <laughs> <laughs> the caustic adder. Damage from its poison bite is always lethal. The undying cat. Sacrificing the poor beast does not kill it. I want the kitty. You may only choose one. Another creature joins your caravan. Yeah, the cat is the best one to get, in my opinion. Some of the creatures of the forest seem unwilling to follow you. Uh, willing. Oh, yeah, I read that wrong. You came across an abandoned sack. I got a squirrel! You found a squirrel in a bottle. Break it in case of emergencies. And have a second. Another useful implement. I'll allow you to tip the scales with it. Three is as much as you can carry. Right. God, look, this dude talks too much. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, he was always a talker. You are ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. <coughs> you sacrificed me while I was sleeping. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe you'll help me. Take your turn. Play along for now. You may now see my moves ahead of time. Alright, so he's gonna throw a wolf cup there. Alright. Not much I can really do about that, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw Whirl. that down, and then we're gonna get the kitty. Whirl. And, and I'll put the cat there, because the cat's not doing any damage anyway. Um from there. Have it starts chopping down on the stump. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go! That might be copyright. I don't know if I can say that. It's fine, I think. Mind the ambitious wolf cub. It ages swiftly. Alright, I've got the river snapper, so I actually want to grab a squirrel so I can get the river squirrel. snapper. Squirrel! Since, uh... Wait, does it have reach? No, but it doesn't matter. It'll hit the bat either way. That's true. Don't! Uh... No, just put it down. Let it kill the bat. Oh yeah, I was gonna do this real quick. Um... Yep. Yep. River sa demands two sacrifices. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> the airborne bat flies over creatures to attack directly. He attacked my life points directly. Oh my god! Flew right over. Flew right over the river snapper. Yep. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Uh, take the, no, take the, yeah, yeah what's the worst that's gonna happen? Anyway. All right. Awesome, perfect. Hmm. Sacrifice nothing. Yeah, I'm thinking that's probably for the best for right now. Because they'll kill, yeah, there we go. And then, squirrel. Uh, could, yeah, get a squirrel. Um, and sacrifice, squirrel there. yeah. And boop, boop, squirrel, boom. And time for them all to die. And, Another big one. Yeah. Because, uh, here's the thing that I'm thinking as well, since that only does one point... Oh, let's see here. I'm gonna get three. Well, I'll get five. So then what I probably should do is I should 
Sacrifice your river snapper. Yeah. Throw it down. And there we go. I don't know why my controller is no longer working. Well, back to the mouse then. There we go. That gives me some overkill. You prevailed and trekked onwards past the now bloodied terrain. The young wolf cub, it grows into a wolf after a single turn. The meek sparrow, an inexpensive if feeble flying creature. Hmm. Take the wolf, like the wolf cub. cub. Yeah, I was gonna say. Because hear me out. Put the wolf cub or sacrifice the wolf cub to the cat. So wait, like throw the cat onto the wolf cub or throw the wolf cub onto the cat? Throw the wolf cub onto the cat. Interesting. Okay. You stumbled into a strange stones in the mist. All right, so we're you gonna... were compelled to choose a worthy sacrifice. One that will be lost forever. Pick me. No. I like how their eyes glow when you enchant them. Mm -hmm. A ghastly spectacle, but the soul of the wolf cub now lives in the cat. Okay, so his wolves are gonna be flying. Behold my totem. It inscribes my canine cards with the airborne sigil. Okay, uh, so we're gonna get the cat out for certain. Yeah. Uh, Honestly, I would go cat in front of coyote and then stoat in front of bat. Well, my reason for I wouldn't. Well, how, how much damage will the cat get? Uh, one. Okay. It'll be a one three, or at least it should be. All right. Uh, then. So yeah. it'll literally turn into as good as the stoat. Yeah, that might not be a bad idea then. All right, I'm just throwing that there. Grab that. Boom, boom. And then get end it for now. Yet, so. Yeah, and then. And... The totem has granted my coyote the power of flight. Hoo <laughs> Elder cat. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna want to grab a squirrel for right now. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna throw that there. Then we're gonna go ahead and grab a wolf and uh, boom, boom, boom. Seems legit. Oh, there we go. Okay, he's gonna get uh, a wolf cub out. So what I probably want is. I would say another special card. You think so? Rather than yeah. getting like the squirrel. The only thing you're gonna get are the one ones. Or another wolf. Yeah. Well, you're right. He's completely insane. You see that, right? You care for the wolves. Pathetic, really. Enough. He keeps me around to watch me suffer. Back on the board. You've damaged four away from winning. Or you're four damage away from winning. Oop. Alright, uh, yeah, might as well grab it. I mean, it's another wolf, but it's fine. Because... I mean, yeah. funny enough, I would say sacrifice the stoat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you get a little bit of overkill. But it wouldn't matter. You know what? I am actually going to go for it. Well, I was going to say... it wow, is seriously? It is, okay. Well, my reason for that is the overkill damage, remember? Yeah, that's true. So it turns out there's actually a way to beat him on your first attempt. Really? Impressive. You may yet survive this ordeal. You have to get incredibly lucky, though. Knock on wood. Well, we'll see if we get that lucky. Essentially what you have to do is you have to get the random encounter for the totem lady and then uh, get the totem that gives your squirrels um um where they never die, where with they die they go back in your hand. Yeah, oh, okay. The ornery porcupine 
Sharp quills await those who dare attack it. The reviled skunk. Its stunch reduces the strength of the enemy. The flighty elk. It moves after attacking. I'd say the porcupine. Yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards porcupine too. Mm. And then put it on the put on the uh, mm. either one honestly, because like doesn't particularly is, matter. Yeah, the fire will really improve one of them at least. Yeah, that's true. Okay, plus one. You came across a small group of survivors. Faces shrunk in from starvation. They huddled around a campfire. They looked upon your group of creatures and beckoned. Come, warm your creatures by the fire, one said. Warm it by the fire. That will enhance it with power, another said. You noticed one of the survivors wiping drool from their mouth. Hmm. hmm. Honestly, put the wolf. Yeah, I was thinking that too. I was debating about whether I wanted to throw the cat there. Can we... A little extra damage. But... Yeah, but the cat's useful as it is right now. I don't feel, see a reason to increase it anymore. That's true. Meanwhile, I'm trying to think, how can we get past, you know, 12 grizzlies? Mm -hmm. The fire warmed the poor wolf, enhancing its power. One of the survivors reached toward it. Another gnashed its teeth. Without a word, you pulled the wolf away from the fire and left. I think my favorite little detail here is if you had the adder, you can throw the adder at the fire and it just dies. It kills them all. <laughs> yeah, it kills them all and then you can use the fire five times. Yeah, that's true. There's a way out for both of us. It's somewhere in this foul cabin. Be silent, or I will tear you to shreds. There's also, in Casey's mod, you can use it multiple times, and if you do, you, uh, uh, there's a chance, the more times you use it, the more chances they're gonna jump on the creature. Yeah, I'm trying to see here, so that grizzly is gonna be a pain. Uh, and I won't hmm. be able to do anything about, well, no, I can, the, so the tree will block that sparrow for a while. What cards do you have right now? I've got the squirrel and stoat and wolf and porcupine. Uh, pass your turn. Er, well, I should probably throw hmm. the squirrel down. Well, technically, yeah. No, the actually, no. Throw the porcupine in front of the bear. That's the That's right thing I'm to do here. That's what I'm too, because like, it will, yeah, it will do extra damage. So. And then yeah, end it there. I don't see reason to use anything else. Oh, Ooh, yeah, another grizzly. grizzly. A thorny rebuke. Alright, and then, honestly, I... I have the squirrels in a bottle, so I'll do that. Hmm. So it's gonna do four this is... One. Yeah, hmm. Well, well, wait a minute. Wait what? a minute. Use the two squirrels and you can win. Really? We dealt one damage. You only need five to win. One of the... Wolves do four damage. Oh, you're friggin' right. Amazing. Uh, making sure I grab the right one. And I throw him there. We went. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, you suck. <laughs> we genuinely were gonna win, and he had to cheat. Oh, uh, what a bitch. <laughs> He's mad. Oh, he's so mad. What a butt. I'll grab a squirrel and throw the stone yeah. up, because might as well. You can, well, I guess you can technically kill the one grizzly. No, you can't. No, you can get close. Can't. Yeah. You get it down to one health. Mm -hmm. This spot? You sure? No. Yeah. No, we're not. Also, I just want to get rid of this. I just don't want to have that in my inventory for next time. A well-earned point of damage. <laughs> oh, that's still gonna help, isn't it? <laughs> you didn't think you would rely 
I didn't think you would really do it. Yeah, what do you think, motherfucker? <laughs> you cheating bitch. That sucks. We were gonna win. I know. You've lost. lost. Using this as a learning opportunity may be the only way to mitigate my disappointment. Get up. Get up from the table. Fetch me the candlestick from atop the barrel beside the door. As he cheated. Uh, wait, yeah, here's the candles. No, not. Nope. Eh. We only get two, we don't get the three lives. Bring it here. God, you have bony fingers. Now sit back no. down. Let me explain something to you. That was one of the two mistakes you can make here. If you make a another, I must sacrifice you. Now where were we? Well, you know what? I think that that's a good point to call it for this episode. Yeah. Because we're probably going to get to the minor next episode, so say goodbye, everyone. Yeah.